Hello, today I'm bringing you a video review of the 93 brand uh, narrow width finger tape. Uh, full disclosure, I purchased this tape. It was not provided for me. Uh, it was $9 for six single rolls. They're narrower rolls. They're about a half an inch in width. Um, they're blue and covered in American flags, some sort of kanji. Um, Japanese flags and Brazilian flags. I don't know how well you can see this, but they pick up debris like crazy, so it must be at least fairly sticky. I normally tape my fingers uh, with athletic tape. I tear it down into narrower strips, so uh, it'd be interesting to compare it. What I'm gonna do, uh, open mat starts in 30 minutes. What I'm going to do is I'm going to tape my left hand with the athletic tape and my right hand with the blue 93 brand tape. And then we're going to uh, see how it holds up after two hours of open mat. So let's tape the left hand first. Pull out some of this. For those of you that are looking to start taping your fingers or maybe looking for a more effective way, this is how I do it. I'll uh, start in front of the knuckle and get a good loop around it. Once I get about halfway across the side, uh, after I have a loop, I will cross. So I will cross the knuckle, make that same loop. and bring it back across. Get at least another half a loop on there. I'm not taping it super tight because then it's restrictive, but enough pressure that it does provide support. I don't want to cut off the circulation of my finger, but that is, that's how I tape my fingers. Um, Seen a few people do it this way. So I'll go ahead and uh, tape my other hand and uh, we'll come back. All right, initial impressions while pulling this tape on the, the blue 93 brand tape. It pulls easier than the athletic tape does. Um, it is a little wider than I normally run, but we'll just see how that works out. Um, it does separate from the roll easier though. Get my loop go across. I don't have the largest hands. <laughs> um, I'm at I'm at five eight, so I'm not the not the biggest guy either. Okay, it does tear easier than the athletic tape too, which is interesting. Um, doesn't look maybe as pretty. Um, doesn't feel super restrictive though either. We'll, we'll just have to see how it holds up. All right, so two hours later, uh, we can now compare 
each hand. The left hand with the regular athletic tape and the right hand um, with the 93 tape. Still, ultimately, I, I'd say did the job, um, but it's more, it's more, more tattered. Um, wanted to peel off quite a bit more, if you can see that. And I think it's a little more prone to, to just being soaked with sweat. I think it'd still be good if you were taping around a finger and another finger, just, you know, trying to like isolate two fingers together. But if you're trying to do like the, the different joint patterns and stuff, I don't know that it's as useful. Um, but it's still pretty cheap. It's also, it's a little, th it's just, I think too thick. Um, I think maybe cut in half, it might be better. So, uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Um, I hope you found this helpful. Uh, you'll see this product come up for sale, I think pretty often on BJJ HQ and sites like that. Uh, so I hope you, I hope this helps you out. Uh, feel free to leave a comment down below if you have any other tape suggestions. Uh, I, I do like the thinner stuff, so let me know what you like. Uh, like, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future uploads. Best of skill to you, and I hope we get to roll.